Hello, and welcome to another episode of the GST Clinic. My name is Dylan, and today we will be looking at a key skill for communication, and that is listening. So, what is listening? To communicate effectively, we need to be able to do two things. First, speak so that people can understand what we say. And secondly, listen to people and understand what they say. So what do we look for? How do we assess listening? As part of the GST, we will assess your listening ability. We do this by asking you different types of questions and evaluating you on how well you understood the question and if you needed the interviewer to repeat the question or to rephrase the question. It is important to remember that every question has a purpose, a reason, and we are testing your ability. So there are three things that we look for when assessing someone's listening ability. Firstly, did they understand the question? Secondly, did they answer the question appropriately. For example, if I ask about your job and you start talking about a different topic, then that's not an appropriate answer. Finally, if I ask you a multi-part question, did you answer all the parts or just some of the parts? A multi-part question is a question with many different parts. So for example, if I ask you about your last vacation, when was it, where did you go, and what was the best thing about that vacation, you should be able to answer all those parts. If you forget some of the parts, don't worry. You can always ask the interviewer to repeat the question, just like in a normal conversation. So it's important for you to make sure that you work on your listening ability. Okay, how can you improve? Here are four tips on how you can improve your listening ability. Firstly, relax. <sighs> Being stressed, nervous, or anxious won't help your listening. So the first things first, just relax and do your best. Next, listen to a range of sources. There is a wealth of material out there designed for all levels, from very simple to very complex. You can listen to the news in English, see the BBC, CNN, Arirang News. You can listen to music. You can watch TV or movies with or without English subtitles. Or you can listen to podcasts that interest you. Don't choose anything that's too difficult. But if you want to improve your listening, you need to find time to regularly listen to people using English. Next, study vocabulary. The more vocabulary you know, the more you can understand when you are listening to English being used. Find a way of improving your vocabulary and your listening will also be improved because you will understand more. And finally, speak to people in English. Communication requires listening and speaking. By practicing your speaking, you will naturally improve your listening as you become used to the way that English is spoken. So, join a class, make some foreign friends, join an English community, or even with your colleagues. Try to practice your speaking and your listening will also improve. The most important thing is that you are actively listening. When listening, you need to try and catch the words expressions, and grammar being used. I will add some resources and links under the video, so make sure you check out those resources and begin practicing your listening as soon as possible. And remember to relax during your GST. If you don't understand a question, don't worry about it. Just ask the interviewer to repeat the question and they will be happy to do so. So, how about you start practicing your listening skills right away? See you next time.